Hey guys, I'm LB, and we are back playing After Tag, The Power of Paint. And we were trying to figure out how to follow these arrows. And I think I might have an idea. We're gonna see if it works. Okay, so now we're up here, right? Sweet science! You have the bladder of a pregnant woman! Go do your business and get back to the testing as soon as you are done. <laughs> Is this like a bathroom area or something? <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, I didn't know about this. Can we do something like this? Not really. Unless we do it on the edge, maybe. No, I think they intentionally made it so that you can't. Yeah, okay. But we can do something like this. Still better than nothing. doesn't really get us over on top of this, though. Which is what I was trying to do. Okay, real quick, I wanna know what this button does. Oh, it turns off the gel. Awesome. I don't even know why we wanted the gel in the first place, to be honest. To be perfectly clear... Okay, that worked. So now we can actually put the cube there. The question is, how do we even get the cube there? Oh, it thinks I'm standing on it. Duh. Okay, we can take the cube through here, right? <laughs> well, assuming we don't forget to jump, we can take the cube through there, yes. No! No! Come on, let me do it. Not like that, please. <laughs> oh boy. And I'm not moving my save, because I want to see if I can get up there still. Don't- it keeps trying to- it keeps wanting me to go to the face plate. I don't want to do that. Okay, here we go. Brilliant. Now go ahead and get on the platform ride. Hmm. Oh, I should have just used the faceplate. I'm an idiot. Well, we know what to do now. I still want to get up. Oh, it it saves here. Okay. I still want to figure out how to get up there. That is intriguing me. That's not what I wanted to do. Oh, it loads this save. Okay. Interesting. Well, let's put this down. 
Because I don't think I can fit in there. How would we get up there, though? That's got a lip over it. I guess we all the way up here? Wow. Okay. Can we bounce all the way around and get up here like that? I mean, it's worth a try, but it's pretty crazy. <laughs> wow, okay. I messed that up. Try it. It's gonna take a while, but I wanna try it. This is absolutely insane, but I am gonna do it. Ooh, can we... No! <laughs> I was so close, I- I almost made it on top of that thing, and that would've... ...been significantly helpful. Let's try that one more time. I know this can be done. And I'm gonna do it. No! <laughs> Gosh dang it, I hit my head on his rail. Come on. Yes! Yes! Okay. Now that we're up here, <laughs> I'm gonna save my game again. And, uh... Hmm... I wonder... Can we simply do this? I wonder. Nope, it's not that simple. Well then... What if we bounced on that corner? Actually, can we land on that corner? I wonder. Almost. I'll give that one more try. Oops, that was a bad try. Hmm. I know this has gotta be doable. I just don't know how yet. Cause originally I was gonna go around and try and do that. But I don't think I can do that. I don't think I can make that. Oh! 
Oh, oh! I can totally make the jump now. Well, not like that. I mean... I need a bit more of a run-up. Actually... No, that's a bit lower, never mind. Come on. It's because I keep running off the slope by mistake. Yes! I did it! What's my reward? Where is this? <laughs> did I go somewhere I'm not supposed to? Again? You did your business not so long ago. Why do you even bother with exploring your surroundings? It's not like you're going to encounter a life-changing moment. <laughs> what? Oh! <laughs> Okay, well... We know how this is going to end. <laughs> Am I getting some sort of alternate ending here or something? Okay, both our jails back. Yeah, good. So now, now that we've that got that out of the way, we can go back and finish the test chamber. Yes, we can. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, so. Oh, that was close. <laughs> I wonder if I'm gonna get, like, some sort of secret ending for what I accomplished. Just turrets, huh? So far, just turrets. going on here? I can't shed out too many details, but get ready. Aim and fire! And someone from industrial engineering will be fired too. Well, <laughs> so long for a dramatic and grand finale. I like how he's sideways. What the? <laughs> and that concludes our testing. You were a great test subject. Uh, testing procedure says there should be a fire here where you die, and that should have concluded the end of the test. Oh, I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> Although I am very glad you did not have to die. Give me a minute. Might I remind you guys, this is a blind playthrough. Okay. I didn't even know so that this is something I could do. Of a previous test subject. She almost blew up the whole facility and killed my boss once. So I have instructions to let you go to avoid any future problems. Go through the door. <laughs> awesome. Okay. This door up here. This elevator will take you to the surface. We won't meet again. 
This is it. Goodbye. You know, you were my first test subject. You will always have a deep place inside my gears. Farewell, my human test subject. <laughs> Wow, my first playthrough and I get some sort of special ending. This is cool, I really like that. Thank you for bearing with me in with me wasting so much time to get that special ending. <laughs> so many names I recognize and so many I don't. I like this game. The writing was a bit sporadic, but other than that, I really liked it. It didn't have too many issues, and, uh, yeah, it was actually longer than I expected it to be. I highly recommend you play this if you haven't already. This is a good song. I'll have to find this. the ending for a moment there. Well guys, thanks for watching. Uh, that's it for Aperture Tag the Power of Paint. Kind of. Because you see, we have community test chambers here, thanks to uh, Benjamin. Cave Johnson oh, it's here. just a standard video. Every standard time I video. look at our test chamber production line, I am reminded of my father. Now, he wasn't a scientist, just a simple farmer, a professor of farming at the local farm college. Never farmed a day in his life, but his theories on farming are the backbone of this company. Do it from scratch. Spare no expense. And never cut corners. Well, that's a corner-cutting machine. We obviously cut them there. Point is, we've always done things the way my father did. And his father before him, and his father before him, and his father before him. And we are almost bankrupt. So, time for a cheaper approach. Allow me to introduce... The Multiverse. Infinite Earth with an infinite number of apertures. And as of now, they are going to take over all test chamber construction. And more importantly, all paying for test chamber construction. Why are they agreeing to do that? They're not. We're tricking them. Here's how it works. One, design a test. Two, slip the mole monsters or what have you, the blueprint, when they're not looking. Three, once they build it, steal it back. Look at that sad little octopus. <laughs> That's where you come in. We need blueprints. We are about to run the greatest con game in the history of the multiverse, and you are the bottleneck. Yes, you. Get back to work. So yeah, this game has its own workshop, and it has levels for a said workshop. And, uh, I want to see how, uh... Oh. <laughs> Okay, apparently, it, uh, does it not distinguish levels? Okay, so it does distinguish them here. And, uh, oh yeah, this is the, uh, this is the guy who helped make, uh, yeah, this is the guy who made this possible for Aperture Tag, getting the, uh, community workshop integration and all that. So let's see, I wanna create a new test chamber. I want to see what the elements are like and all that, and how it- how it works. And after that, we'll just end the episode. 
Oh yes, it's it's B's extended editor with even more stuff. Ooh, we've got crushers, we've got trigger blocks, logic gates, orange portal, blue portal. We've got all our gels and paint fuel enable all, enable blue, enable orange, disable all. Cool. Awesome. So, Oh, we get doors. I have not gotten to mess with doors. Uh... How do I... Cool! And let's put a, uh... button on it. And, uh, I wanna try it out real quick and then we'll end the episode. Cool stuff. <laughs> I like the dripping aperture logo. I know I said that in like the first episode, but whatever. I just want to see how the levels start and end. Okay, so that's pretty standard. Oh, that's cool. Yep. <laughs> that's kind of buggy, though, how it kind of goes through the door. I mean, don't you think that's kind of, uh... strange? And unlike Portal Stories Mel, this door will not crush me. Yes. Well, guys. Oh, I didn't enable any paint. <laughs> well, guys, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the... the next one. Goodbye!